Hi everyone, Frank Spangler for Study English with Us, and today we're going to continue our series on idioms, and today's phrase is the calm before the storm. The calm before the storm. Let's go. You have probably heard one of your friends use this phrase in English and wondered what they meant. Uh, this is probably just the calm before the storm. The calm before the storm. And what they're really saying is that, yeah, everything might be okay right now. Everything seems peaceful. Everything is going great. But I have a feeling that we're in for a difficult time. And so what we're experiencing right now is just a peaceful time before we get hit by a big storm. And sometimes it can refer to the weather when someone says this. You might be sitting out in the porch, uh, sipping your lemonade. It's nice and warm out. It seems like a nice peaceful day. It's not very windy. And someone might say, it's a nice day today, but I think this is just the calm before the storm. And so it might actually be referring to a weather event where it's, it's not windy right now and it's warm, it's great, but I have a feeling that later today we're going to get really hit by a bad storm. But it is more than just the weather. When people use this phrase, they might be talking about their life and the life of people in the office. Things might be just going wonderful at the office or in a person's life, but they know that this probably won't last very long, this wonderful, peaceful time, and that something ominous, something bad is about to happen. And they got this feeling that, I don't know, it's, it's nice right now, but I have this feeling that something difficult is about to come our way. And so they might say, yeah, it seems like everything's going okay, but I, I think this is just the calm before the storm. The calm before the storm. You know, if you're ever in a hurricane, or a typhoon, uh, depending on where you live, they call them different things, you can find yourself in the eye of the storm. Maybe as the uh, hurricane started coming your way, you got into a cellar or a basement hideout, and the wind passed and blew hard, and then it, everything got calm and peaceful. So you might come up out of the cellar thinking that the storm is over, because everything is so calm and peaceful. But someone who knows better might say, no, we're only in the eye of the storm. We're only in the calm before the rest of the storm will hit us. We need to get back down into our underground shelter uh, before the rest of the storm hits. The calm before the storm. See if you can use it uh, sometime this week at your office in a phrase as you're talking with your English-speaking friends. I think they'll be impressed if they hear you say, everything seems to be going okay, but I'm afraid that this might just be the calm before the storm. Give us a like if you found this helpful, share it with your friends, and uh, subscribe to us on YouTube for more lessons like this at Study English With Us. We'll catch you down the road. That's actually another <laughs> idiom, I think. I'll catch you down the road. In other words, I'm just basically saying, later in life, we'll see you again. It might be tomorrow might be next week, but we'll catch up to each other down the road. That's my bonus for today. So long for now.